Now, we are interested to know if the mean height of students in the College of Pharmacy is less than 165 centimeters. Again, this is the research point. From it, we will write the alternate hypothesis. The H1 will be the X bar is less than 165 centimeters. And the H note will be that X bar is more than or equal to 165 centimeters. From the alternate hypothesis, the H1, now we have the less than sign, the angle is pointing to the left side. So, since the angle points to the left, this is a left one-tailed test. If we are looking to the normal distribution curve, the rejection region will be to the left side, to the left tail, or the tail of the lower values. The lower values are to the left. القيم الصغرى دائما في الناحية اليسرى في الذيل الأيسر بينما القيم الكبرى دائما في ناحية الذيل أو الناحية اليمنى. So if the mean value of heights of students in the College of, Med of Pharmacy is much less than 165, we will be able to reject the null hypothesis. So this shaded area concerns the values that are significantly less than 165 centimeters. All the other values other than the shaded areas, we will be able, we will not be able to reject the H note. So this condition will be called failure to reject the H note. We have the level of significance called alpha. We have the critical value from the tables, statistical tables, and we have the rejection regions which are shaded. This is a left tail test. This is the critical value and this is alpha, the shaded area. This is a right tail test. This is a critical value to the right. This is alpha and this is the shaded area to the right side. Again, here we have a two-tailed test in which on the right side there is alpha by two and on the left side there is alpha by two.